Oh, 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 my car, please, 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 car. Painting game, we are starting a new vlog, man. I'm not super crunk, man, but I am super excited. We having a, a moment right now, man. We're about to start our birth vlog, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Bay said her mucus plug broke, uh, came out, and her water broke. So it's not a prank, you guys, man. This might be the actual real thing. So I don't know where she's at, but we gotta go, man. We got everything ready. Where's your mom? Mommy. Bay? Oh, uh, she's in the bathroom right now, so. We got everything ready. Girl, y'all bring, bring that stuff right there to the car. So we about to head out, man. House is a little messy right now, so don't mind that, man. We'll get all that taken care of. But we got the bags in the car right now. You Know what I'm saying? And of course, we can't forget the car seat. I didn't latch it in here yet because I know Bay's gonna want to recline and I don't want the screen to get on there. But we do got it secure, you know what I'm saying? It's secure. But who is this? I'm not sure how to use this part right here, but this part is last. We're ready to go. I'm saying green is good. So this part is ready. All we gotta do is when he's ready, we put that in there and we're good to go, man. So hopefully it's that moment, man. Make sure y'all like this video, subscribe to the family if you're not subscribed, man. And for the people that's been following us through this journey, man, y'all know what happened previous year earlier. And we're here now, man. Base ready. How you feeling, babe? Having All right, she's having contractions, so come on, babe. Let's get on in here, babe. Let's get on in here. Whoa, whoa. Don't sit on that napkin. All right, so we'll see you in a little bit, man. I don't want to keep talking, talking. We got to get there, man. Yeah, you your mom chip on your, your little foot stuff. All right, love you guys. DJ, love you, big boy. Love you, yeah, yeah. We'll see you in a little bit. Oh, uh, my mom is coming down, so or coming up. She's coming here to watch the kids for us. Oh, so we're gonna have Bryson in the back seat. We're gonna be looking at him like, what you Three doing back there? Yeah, three days. So uh, we can ship you out, yeah, yeah. You wanna go to boarding school? Sure. <laughs> I'm just playing game. We love y'all, man. We appreciate y'all. Thank you guys for tuning in. Have a blessed day, man. Hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. We love you guys. Hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed, man. Hit that post notification bell. We get all our lit videos and we out, babe. Let's go, babe. Any speed bumps you wanna hit? Are you good? She's out of it. All right, gang. Okay. Hey, Panting Gang. So we just left the house. So you guys, I think my water broke. I'm not 100% sure, but I was getting like contractions. In our last vlog, I told y'all I was having contractions all day and they just started getting stronger. And then when I was laying on the bed, I heard like a pop sound. And then when I had got up, I know it's TMI, but this is natural, you guys. My, my like panties was soaked. Like I did break my water and then when I went on the toilet, it was like, I don't know if I was peeing or if it was leaking, but it was so much water coming out. And then I ended up losing my mucus plug. It was the, you know, like the bloody show. If y'all have kids, y'all know what I'm talking about. And I remember when I had DJ, I had lost my mucus plug. And then um, a couple of hours later, I started having really bad contractions. So yeah, I ended up, losing my mucus plug with DJ and then I started having the contractions and I had the baby that night. I I started having really, really, really bad contractions. When I had timed them, I was having, I had three and 10 minutes or three and 11 minutes. So, oh my gosh, you guys. Well, um, I just wanna make sure the baby's okay. When I seen that blood, it, it like scared me. So we're headed to the hospital. And we're gonna see if today's the day, if if he's ready to come out, if my water did break, then I'm gonna have him. If not, then 
they'll probably send me home. Cause I always hear all these stories about these women who get sent home because it's false labor. So I don't know if this is real labor or if I'm having false labor, but we gonna see you guys. We'll, we'll vlog as we can. So talk to you in a little bit. All right guys, so we checked in. We got a little room right here. They yeah, they're run. gonna check me to see if my water really Yeah, they're gonna run some tests and stuff. So it's probably gonna be a long process. Hopefully everything can start. We'll see, we'll let y'all know. Okay. All right, guys, so they ran some tests. We've got to wait for like 30, 40 minutes. The doctor said she is having contractions, so she sees that part. They had some more fluid leaked out, right? Yeah, but they're testing it because they're trying to make sure it's not me peeing on myself. Yeah, you I, still be peeing on yourself, I right? I know. I'm <laughs> just playing. I'm just playing. So, yeah, they had to get checked in because they said it's a lot of times pregnant women, they think it's their water breaking, but they're actually just peeing on themselves because the pressure, baby. But um, I actually think you might have your water breaking because if you're having that and contractions, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like that's all connected, right? You know? Yeah, we gonna see. All right, so we gotta sit tight, man. We in this cubicle, this room. We can wait here for like 40 minutes, man. And we'll let y'all know. To y'all, it's gonna be like a second, but for us, it's taking forever, man. How long have we been here? Maybe an hour. Hour, yeah, we've been here for an hour already. Oh, no. You know see, man? It's getting into the nighttime. <sighs> y'all pray for us. All right, guys, so the test came back, man, and her water broke. I told you I'm on myself. You about to get admitted. Admitted, baby. You about to be admitted. Bryson about to come, man. Well, you still got 24 hours, so it's going to probably be a long journey, but you ain't leaving this hospital without him, babe. That's that's pretty much how it's going down. You know that, right? Yeah. You're about to have a third child, yo. It's crazy. Yeah, it is crazy. My God, it's good, man. We just pray. Hopefully, everything goes smooth and well. And we have two healthy people at the end of this pregnancy, which is you and Bryson. I can't wait, babe. This start. So right now it's May 29th. We know for sure he's not coming tonight because what they said you one centimeter. Yeah, but my water broke. Yeah, so her water broke, but she's one seven. Or one, I don't know what they call it. My one seven. Oh, okay. So with that being said, I gotta be at a ten. ten. Yeah, we're looking at twenty four hours. So he's probably gonna be May thirtieth, May thirty first. I'm real happy about that. You know what I'm saying? But because that means we're gonna all have threes in our birthday. You know that right there? Yeah, I'm texting your mom. Yeah, all right. Text your mom too, man. And, Manta gang, are y'all ready? Y'all comment down below right now. Are y'all ready? Are y'all ready for Bryson? Y'all ready for a third panting baby? Are y'all ready, man? <sighs> I'm ready. My feet is like, <laughs> uh, it's just like antsy right now. I can't wait. All right, guys, so I'm about to FaceTime y'all, y'all. All right, so. Hello. Hello. What you doing, bro? I'm in my room. I'm actually watching Grays right now, and they're having a baby. Yo, can you take that off the screen, please? Panting squad do not want to see that. <laughs> Are y'all excited? Yeah, I was just on the phone with mom. Where's DJ? I think he's downstairs. Okay, did y'all eat? I can't hear you. You're like breaking up. Bye, girl. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with her, y'all. She can't hear me, but anyway, she was talking to her mom earlier. I just decided to call her so y'all can see her because I already know y'all in common. Where is y'all at? Where is y'all at? Only, we could only have one person be here. Of course, I'm gonna be here. You know what I'm saying? Because of, you know, the pandemic was going on, but I can't wait, man, till we get to our room. They are gonna admit her, man. I'm so excited, babe. You're not looking excited, babe. I'm trying to watch a video about... Oh, okay. Oh, 
Hey Pantene gang, so you guys, I did the COVID test. I was so scared, that was my first time ever getting tested. And I just got my results, they came back negative, thank you Jesus. I didn't have no symptoms, but I just wanted to come back negative because they told me if it comes back positive, Don wouldn't be able to stay in the hospital with me. No, I can stay in the room with you. Yeah, but I'm just happy it's negative. He get to stay the whole time. He don't have to leave. They said I could actually have two people, so we might see if Yaya could come, but I don't know if she's too young. They, Yaya keep asking me to come. No, she can come. They put an IV in me, and I know last time when I had DJ, the IV got me so swollen, got me so bloated. Oh, hell no! They're gonna, because my um water broke, they said we're on a time limit. I have to deliver quick so I don't get an Not infection. Quick. Not quick. Like you have 24 to 48 hours to deliver, but because my water broke, they want the baby out of me. They're going to give me the Pitocin. I really didn't want to do Pitocin because that makes your contractions hurt more. I didn't want to do that, but you guys, I'm telling y'all right now, I'm getting the epidural. I don't care. I'm not good with pain. I can't even handle period pains. Like, babe, can I handle period pains? <laughs> so, with Yaya, I had an epidural. With DJ, I had an epidural. With Bryson, I'm about to have an epidural. But thank you, Jesus. The COVID test came back negative. They're going to switch us to our room, and I'm going to get the Pitocin, and your girl going to be in some real pain. I'm not going to be able to talk much. That's why I came and talked. I've been having contractions here and there. When I do get them, they hurt real bad, but they're not close. But I know the Pitocin about to kick my ass. But anyways, I just wanted to come out here real quick. And thank you, babe, for being with me. All right, guys, so we're in our suite right now. It's a nice little suite. Well, I ain't gonna say it's a suite, but this is where we're gonna be delivering Bryson. I guess he's gonna be in this this machine thing right here. Yeah, babe, she's, she's on meds right now. She's kind of sleeping. So I was just gonna show you how to run. Get snacks in here. Yeah. Your boy is hungry right now, man. I need some food, but, but she's she's hanging in there. She's at two centimeters right now. And uh, we're just gonna wait. The time is, I think it's almost 10, 10 p.m. So I got in all our bags and stuff. You know, we got Bryce and stuff. And he's blowing on. We got the little pillow for babe and she breastfeeding. And then we got his doctor bag, some stuff already. And she got her bag over there. So. I'm just gonna hang in, man. I'm about to cut the lights off and let her go to sleep for a couple of hours because she's on bed. So they're gonna come back in two hours. So I'm praying, man. Hopefully, hopefully everything just go well. Get the TV in here too. Probably watch some NBA. I got my mask. Probably could watch some NBA basketball or something to kick back. But Bryce is gonna be here soon, man. I can't wait. Love you guys. All right, guys. So it's about to be 11 o'clock. We got one more hour. Bay's up now, but she's in a lot of pain. She's been squeezing my hand like crazy. Oh. All right, babe? Oh. I'm sorry, babe. I am sorry. You women are like something special, man. But look at her feet. It says it's a boy. And they came in here, they fixed up that area. So they getting ready for Bryson, man. But I'm sorry, man. I, I feel bad, but you ladies have to go through for Bryson. I'm sorry, I don't know what to do, y'all. She's been squeezing my hand a lot. Right, so we're just waiting right now before she could take, uh, you gotta take epidermal. What, how you say, epidermal? She gotta take some epidermal. So we're waiting on that for them to come and give that to her. I guess that process is gonna start and it's gonna end up being May 30th. All right, I'm gonna go now. All right, guys, I don't know, this thing is like beeping, bro. Babe, you all right? Give me a hand, babe. Yeah, I'm sorry. Right? I'm sorry, babe. Babe. Oh my gosh. I don't know how y'all do it. Alright, babe. Oh my gosh, it's so bad. It's bad. Oh. 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 They call her, please. Okay, please. Right. Please call her. Please. Alright, guys, so. Bae's doing a little better. She got her epidermal shots. She's this is like, not, epi not epidermal. What is it called? Epidermal. Same thing, babe. Tomato, tomato. So she's laying now. She's resting right now. They're about to check her uh, centimeters. This, this is so good. 
Oh, servers. All right, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna say this wrong because I got some checkers, man. Some Uber Eats, man. This thing is busting, man. I got the churro fries. <laughs> I didn't even know they had that. This thing tastes so good. I got the chicken bites with some fry. Oh my God. I'm hungry. Bro, it's so cold in here. It's like it's on Antarctica in here, bro. You not freezing? It's cold, bro. You need to turn the AC down. But yeah, man, so it's about to be midnight. Oh, that's why I got on the camera, y'all, cause it's about to be midnight. Let me see what time it is. Yeah, 11.55, yes, sir. So, He's definitely gonna come on the 30th, you know what I'm saying? So he's gonna have a three on his birthday. Just like all of, just like me. Just like me in there, DJ. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So that's what's up, man. Thank you, God, I appreciate that, man. But anyways, we're gonna see how far along she came. Yeah. All right, guys, so babe, her blood pressure was really low, but we've been praying and stuff, and we got up a little higher. They went to go get medicine, but hopefully she don't need it. Um, she was shivering and stuff, and I just can't believe, like, the pressure. I need her oxygen. Yeah, she got her oxygen mask oh. on, but I just can't believe, like, you know, the stuff women gotta go through to give birth, man. Like, I'm just, like, just <sighs> scared. I'm nervous right now. I'm so nervous. But, baby, we're gonna pull through. We're gonna keep praying. We're actually gonna be here shortly. It's almost 1 o'clock, so. Let's fight, guys. Let's fight. Love you, all right? Oh, I'm so... Guys, like her heart rate is like, oh man, like it's in the 80s now, it's at 96, 52. So it went up a little bit, but it's not where it's supposed to be at. And I'm just like worried, man. So I'm just gonna end this vlog because I don't know what's gonna happen, man. She just laying here. Hey, the baby heart rate is good, but anyways, man, thank you for tuning in, man. Huh? Oh, I'm a bunch man. They're here, they're here. All right, man, so they got the doctors in there right now. Oh, I'm about to close this vlog out, man. We need some prayers, man. And I'm not even real stressed out right now. Um, I thank you guys for tuning in. I love you guys. Appreciate you guys. Make sure you like this video, subscribe. Comments, prayers, stuff from Melinda and Bryson, man. Hopefully everything goes good. I know it's going to go good because we have faith. We believe, but man, we'll see you on the next video. Show me love cause it's my family